anger needs to rise on the inside of you. I'm talking to you. I said the holy anger must, must, must come up on the inside of you. Become angry about where the enemy has left you. Become angry about the things that have blocked you. Become angry about your delayed destiny. Become angry about your delayed prophet. A holy anger must rise up on the inside of you. And you need to do like what Bishop says. Tell yourself. Hallelujah. Tell yourself. This is not my level. Tell yourself I'm better than this. Tell yourself I'm bigger than this. Tell yourself limitations are breaking. Hallelujah. You need to tell yourself. He says, by you, I will pull down kingdoms. Jeremiah 51, 20. By you, I will pull down kingdoms. Be, by you, I will pull down the horse and his rider. By you, I will pull down Auntie who's a wizard. By you, I will pull down Tete. By you, Ladiba Godabahaya. There is an anointing. If you dare to receive, even you who's online, receive a confrontative anointing. You will begin to pray confrontational prayers. Where you confront enemies in your family. You confront them spiritually. Is it not them that have been sending serpents to you in the night all these years and you just took it and took it and took it. But now you are going to send fire of the Holy Ghost. You will send fire. You will send fire. Receive fire so you can send it. I said you will send fire. His empowerment at KPM. Greatness will cost you. It will cost you. You need to look for power for you to achieve greatness. Receive the power to confront. Power to confront. Power to confront. It's not that men are Elijah. Who confronted the 400 prophets of Baal? He didn't wait for them. He went to them. To de we are not waiting. We are going into your enemy's camp. We are going to your relatives that have said, Aurore, business We are confronting them. Just receive the power to confront the enemy. God will give you words in your mouth that no enemy can resist her. I mean, Luke 21 verse 15. No enemy can resist her. Look at the Receive the power. I said receive the power. Power to confront. Power to confront. Spirit, husband and wife. Power to confront. Receive the power. Somebody is receiving power. Somebody is receiving power. Receive power over all powers of the enemy. We have shifted gears. We are changing our stories. We can't be fasting and praying for nothing. My address must change. My car must change. My level must change. My income must change. My business must change. My marriage must change. My children must change. I must go upwards. I must go forward. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost. I wish somebody would receive some power. I wish somebody would receive an anointing to confront the strong man. Receive power. Receive another dimension of God's glory. Some of you, the right hand of God is upon your life. The hand of the Lord was upon you. The hand of the Lord is upon you. When the hand of the Lord is upon you, you have power. 
power over all the powers of the enemy. We are not playing games here. We are not here to play church. We are here to receive power. It is a dimension of the power of the Holy Ghost. Receive power wherever you are. Receive power over the strong men. That's why David said, by my God, I can run through a troop. Psalm 1829. And by you, O God, I can leap over a wall. Receive power to break out and to break through in the name of Jesus. After your breakthrough, you will not be contained. You will break out in the name of Jesus. Receive power, son, over all powers. We are receiving power. He is an empowerment. Angels of fire. I refuse to pastor a powerless church. Everyone under the sound of my voice who has had the enemy having his way in your life for years and years and years, receive empowerment to confront him. These are not normal tongues. I'm empowering you. Ecclesiastes chapter number 6 from verse number 1. There is an evil I have seen under the sun. A man to whom God has given wealth and honor and riches, but he has not given him power to consume it. He says a foreigner has been consuming it. The strong man has been consuming your things because you didn't have power to eat your own things. I don't know about you, but somebody, under the sound of my voice, you are receiving power to drive a new car, power to buy a new house, power for your business to go forward, power for you to get into a new level. It's an empowerment platform. Every son and daughter in this ministry who is truly connected receive power of a COVID. Receive power of a COVID. I said power of a COVID. I feel a tangible anointing. I feel a serious anointing. Even you who's online, you better receive that anointing. Hallelujah. You are not watching a man on a cell phone. It's a divine encounter. Anyone who has assigned themselves as a representative of the strong men, you are joking. I confront you where you are. Any sickness, any disease due to witchcraft in the name of Jesus receive healing. People are being healed all over the world. Lift up your right hand. Say hiding enemies in my life. Come out of your hiding place. Problems in my life waiting to manifest on my day of glory come out in the name of jesus you strong men hiding in my life you are coming out in the name of jesus cryptic battles come out of your hiding place anyone under the sound of my voice with the hidden enemies as you pray and clap your hands they must come out as you pray and clap your hands they must come out as you pray and clap your hands they must come out as you Pray and clap your hands. Hidden enemies must come out. Hidden enemies must come out. Hidden enemies must come out. Come out of your hiding place. I said, Come out of your hiding place. Every enemy hiding. No more hiding. 
No more hiding. No more hiding. No more hiding. No more hiding. Come out of your hiding place. Every enemy working against your business, they are coming out of the hiding place. Come out of your hiding place. In the name of Jesus. Enemies, you are coming out of your hiding place. Come 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 must come out of the hiding place in the name of Jesus. The hiding enemies must come out of the hiding place. I said, Spirit husband, come out of your hiding place. Come out of your hiding place. Spirit husband, come out of your hiding place. Lift up your right hand. Say in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, I declare, I decree, any sickness in my body, hiding, waiting to attack me, let me go. Come out of your hiding place now. Kelando Bazetabahaya. We're not here to play. In the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, you must be set free. I'm talking about you. I said you must be set free. In the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, we strike altars of witches. I said we strike altars of witches. Lord, they are too strong for me. They are too strong for me. Jehovah, arise. Psalm 68 verse number 1. And scatter strong witches. And scatter strong wizards. Arise, O Lord. And scatter them. Lord, in the name of Jesus, I speak to your haters that have turned their hatred into witchcraft. I address them in the realm of the spirits. Every hater of your destiny be quenched in the name of Jesus. May they be quenched in the name of Jesus. Whoever hates you, they will fall for your sake. I said they will fall for your sake. God in the Bible in Psalm 89, round about verse 23, he beat down David's enemies because they hated him. Whoever hates you without a cause, in the name of Jesus, may angels of the living God, may they beat them down in the name of Jesus. Witchcraft done on you. Witchcraft done on you in marriage. Witchcraft done on you in marriage. In the name of Jesus. And by the power of the Holy Ghost, it must expire. It must expire. Witchcraft. Witchcraft of your womb. Witchcraft of your womb must expire in the name of Jesus. Pereta witchcraft. We crash. It must come to an end. Parental witchcraft. It must come to an end. It must come to an end. And because they were jealous of your father. It's parental witchcraft. It's parental witchcraft. Parental witchcraft must be subdued in the name of Jesus. Business be witchcraft. Catch fire! Catch fire! Catch fire. Business bewitchment! Catch fire! Any witchcraft over my business! Catch fire! Any witchcraft over my business! Catch fire! In the name!
name of Jesus, any witchcraft over my business, you are catching fire. The witchcraft grip on your finances, it must cease and it must stop. The witchcraft grip upon your finances must cease and stop. The witchcraft grip, that grip on your finances, it must be broken this day. It must be broken this day. Satanic grip break. Satanic grip break. Satanic grip break. Satanic grip break. In the name of Jesus. Every lacking hidden witch with an evil eye looking at me with an evil eye. By the arrow of the El Elyon I pierce that eye. I pierce that eye. I pierce that eye. That evil eye. Looking at my car with evil. Looking at my ministry with evil. Looking at my marriage with evil. Looking at my children with an evil eye. By the uh, by, the arrow of the El Elyon I pierce that eye. Ladabahaya. His eyes are fixed on you. So you pierce that evil eye. We have got to go across church we pierce that eye we pierce that eye we pierce that eye we pierce that eye that evil eye looking at me secretly open your mouth church the witches must be blind we pierce that evil eye we pierce that eye, we pierce that eye. Open your mouth and pray. We pierce that evil eye, that satanic surveillance. We pierce that evil eye in the name of Jesus. We pierce that evil eye, that evil eye that wants you to die. Casa Doma Jazeta Lira Bahaya. Ah, Lene de Becariando Lamo Casa Dola Mahaya. When I wait a war against evil family altars, I wait a war against evil family altars. Ah, La Doma Katama Zatoma Jazata La Mahaya. Evil altars releasing evil incantation against my life. I decree they are being subdued. Kola Diba Zatoma Haya. They are all just releasing incantation against you. You better open your mouth and pray. Anti-marriage altars. We command you to come down in the name of Jesus. Evil altars, evil altars. Evil altars. Altars releasing poverty. We bring you down, we bring you down, we bring you down. Every altar that has been visited and my name has been mentioned, that altar I command it to fall to the ground. In the name of Jesus, altar, altar, hear the word of the Lord. Be he destroyed. Altar, altar, hear the word of the Lord. Be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Evil altars working against my breakthroughs. Evil altars releasing last minute bad luck. You better open your mouth and pray. Come on, we destroy in the name of Jesus. My altars, we command them to fall to the ground. My crowd, we destroy today in the name of Jesus. Evil family altars, come down, come down, come down. Come on, 
Yes, somebody fight for your destiny. Fight for your breakthroughs. Open your mouth and pray. You will not be disappointed again today. Oh, as you listen, disappointment. Come on, church, open your mouth. Clear the spiritual atmosphere that you may prosper in this land. Evil altars, releasing divorce. I pull you down in the name of Jesus. Evil altars, releasing sickness. Manda boka tola maka tola maka tela rama haya. Azebe keri dene bozo tolo boko di bahaya. Aba boka patela maka satola mahaya. Manda maka tola maka satola mahaya. Alerebe zetele boko di andola mahaya. Andebe keri andola mahaya. Evil altars working against me. I release the power in the blood of Jesus to work against you, O evil altars. In the name of Jesus, every evil altar working against you. Release the power of the blood of Jesus. Madama kota ba kati ba zato mahaya. Andele be keri endele boko di ba kana mahaya. Andama kota ba zato la mahaya. Aze be ketele boko di ando la mahaya. Work against every evil altar. Working against you in the name of Jesus. There are altars that have been erected against your breakthroughs. Such altars must be destroyed in the name of Jesus. E taba kota ba kata la mahaya. I will not be. I will not be disappointed again. Not today. Not today. Not today. Open your mouth against that evil altar. Releasing incantation against breakthroughs. Open your mouth and pray. To work against them as they are working against you. To, to, to frustrate their devices. Every satanic device. Every satanic device working against my progress. I command those devices to be destroyed. In the name of Jesus, we command those words to fall to the ground. Come on, church, retaliate spiritually. Open your mouth and pray. Adaba Katila Ramahaya. Madoba Kate, Jababa Boka Zatola Mahaya, Azababa Badoba Zatola Mahaya, Azebe Ketele Mokodi Mahaya, open your mouth to pray, Enda Makoda Lama Zita Lamahaya, Andele Bekeri and Lamahaya, I refuse to be weak spiritually, Anda Makata Lama Katala Mahaya, Anda Mazotolo Mokodi Mahaya, be strong in the Lord and the power of His might, for we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities and powers, against rulers of darkness, to Today we wage a strong warfare against every power of the devil working against our lives in the name of Jesus. Every satanic altar, we are waging a war against you today. From this altar, we release angels. From this altar, we release the blood of Jesus. From this altar, we release the sword of the Spirit, the Word of God. We neutralize every satanic altar. We neutralize your power. We neutralize your power in the name of Jesus. Altars that have been working against us, even from when we're in the womb. We wage a war against those altars. Altars that are bringing down my star. Altars that are working against my star. Altars that are putting a veil over my beauty. We destroy those altars in the name of Jesus. 
Mahaya, and they make a telebocodi Mahaya, as a Pacota la Maja to Dala Mahaya. Every altar working against you. Today we are waging an aggressive war against those altars. Manda Bacatula Maza to La Mahaya, as a Beke Telebekeri and Dala Mahaya, at the Bos, at Ilana Mahaya. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop her. Keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing her. Once you bring down that altar, I'm telling you, you will see results, you will see a change. Ababa Bakari and Dola Mahaya. Ipapu Pavaka Sunga, Vachiti Vaka Sunga, Zinzako, Vakatora Picture, Yako Vaka Sunga, Vakatita Sunga, Upenu Ake, Asines Taraj Jesu, Motopa Picture, Yo Yo, Motopa Picture, Yo Yo, Vakatora Masha, Sotala Mahaya. They took your virtue. We command that altar to release your virtue in the name of Jesus. Ate Bakatola Vakatila Ramahaya, Adebe Sedebe Keri and Dala Mahaya, Ata Bakatola Masa Tola Mahaya. And the Nebekeri and the Nebekeri and the Lamaha, as a Bakata Lamaha, and the Bekese de Lemokori and the Lamaha, as a Boko Shasata Lamaha, and the Bekeri and the Lamakatu Lamaha, and the Makatila Ramahoya, as a Beke de Lemokoni Mahaya, and the Bekese de Lemokori and the Lamaha. That altar way they took your hair, they are working against your glory. You better open your mouth and open fire on that altar, and the Bakata Lamakatila Ramaha, as a Boka de Bakata. Some of you they took your menstrual pants and they put them on that altar. We wage a war against that altar in the name of Jesus. That altar that is fighting your productivity. We wage a war against that altar. And the Bakatula Mahaya. And the Bekere Zedebekeri and Dula Mahaya. And the Bakatila Mahaya. I wish somebody had 35 minutes just to release fire on the enemy, to release fire on those evil altars. By that time you go to work today, you will see a change. Open your mouth and pray. By the time you do those phone calls, you will see a change. Kadama Sotala Mahaya. By the time you send and receive those emails, you will see a change. For the spiritual atmosphere is going to clear. But right now, in this moment, we release fire against bad luck. Release from those evil altars in the name of Jesus. Last minute failure. We wage a war against you in the name of Jesus. Be aggressive. Pray like a soldier. Open your mouth and pray. Altars that are assigned to assassinate your destiny. We destroy those altars. Altars that are conspiring with family members like Joseph's brothers against you. They said we'll kill him and see what shall become of his dream. We destroy those altars. We wage a war against every altar. Waging a war against my dream. Ate Pakota Bahaya. Ate Kazida Lama Kadulo Bokose Dele Bokodi Bahaya. Ata Bakari and Dola Mahaya. Ande Rebekese Dele Bokeri and Dola Mahaya. Ata Bakati and Dala Mahaya. Asa Bakata Lara Mahaya. Ma Ota Ese. Akurli Samskans. Akuana. Vanavarkit Samarum Benimwe Chinah. A devil is a liar. Vanavarkit Samskans. Vanimwe Chinah. A devil is a liar. We destroy those altars that are releasing her superfluity of naughtiness amongst our children. In the name of Jesus, we are in the month where children are writing exams. And all level exams, A level exams. In the name of Jesus, every altar fighting against my child who's writing exams, even the one who's not writing exams this year, all such altars. Lose my children and let them go. Lose the mind of my child and let it go. Lose the minds of my children and let them go. My child shall be the head. My children shall be the head and not the tail. Above only and not beneath. Every altar that is releasing incantation against my children, against the future of my children, I wage war against that altar. I release fire on that altar. I command fire to begin to fight against you. Open your mouth and pray. 
come higher. Things don't just happen on their own. Things are made to happen spiritually. Open your mouth and pray. This is morning prayer. We are not here to play games. We are here to release the fire of the Holy Ghost against every spiritual enemy. We are here to collect our breakthroughs. We are here to change the spiritual atmosphere. We are here to reconfigure the spiritual atmosphere in which you operate. Open your mouth and pray. You've been operating under a dark cloud. You've been operating under a veil. But by this fire, remove the veil. Remove the veil. The veil of your business. Remove it. Remove it. Remove it. The veil that has been placed on your beauty. Remove that veil. The veil that has been placed on your ideas. People don't even see your good ideas because the satanic veil has been released on your business, on your ideas. Remove that veil in the name of Jesus. Jealousy witchcraft. We destroy it today. We destroy jealousy witchcraft by the power of the Holy Ghost. We release jealousy. We command it to be destroyed. Every jealousy witchcraft. We command it to be destroyed today, 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 today. Any attack upon your life because of jealousy. That attack is thwarted in the name of Jesus. David said, Oh God, there are many who rise up against me. There are many who say of me, Psalm 3, there is no hope for me in God. But you, oh Lord, are my shield, my glory, and the lifter of my head. Open your mouth and pray. Come on. Somebody step it up, step it up, step it up, step it up, step it up. 30 more minutes uh, to clear the spiritual atmosphere. Open your mouth and pray. There must be a change today. Every dark cloud operating over your life sent by the enemy. We command it to be removed. Be thou removed. Be thou removed, you dark cloud. Be thou removed. Every spiritual chain that has been released against your life, be thou destroyed. We destroy that chain in the name of Jesus. Chains of stagnation, be thou removed in the name of Jesus. Family spirits, be ye destroyed in the name of Jesus. You need to be aggressive, otherwise you come out of today with nothing again. Fight every satanic power that says no to your breakthrough. Every satanic power that says not today concerning your breakthrough. Fight it, fight it, fight it, fight it. For today you must see a change. For today you must see a change of story. You better open your mouth and pray. Push, push, push. Pray until something happens. Pray until something happens. Push, push, push. You better open your mouth and pray. Pray until something happens. Pray until there's a change. Pray until you feel something happening. Open your mouth and pray. We are not here to discuss problems. We are here to change our story. Prayer changes your story. Prayer reconfigures your spiritual atmosphere. Prayer changes things in the business realm. You better open your mouth and pray. Powers that fight your marriage. You better fight them today. Powers that say you'll never go anywhere. You better fight those powers. 
Mataba, and the Bakota Baza Dele Bekedi Bahaya, and the Bekedene Boko di Bahaya, as a Baboka de la Rabahaya, a Kabadula Mahaya, and to break through powers. We are waging a war today in the name of Jesus, and the Makatula Mahaya, as we are praying. What are we saying? Arise, O Lord God, let the enemy be scattered. Atabakatula Mahaya, arise, my Father, my God, scatter the enemies of our breakthroughs, scatter the enemies of our destiny in the name of Jesus and the Makatala Mahaya whether they are family spiritual enemies or national spiritual enemies or African spiritual enemies and the Mokatila Ramahaya arise oh my father my God Ateba Katila Mahaya Ezebeke Telebokodi Mahaya and the Rebekeri Andola Mahaya Azebeke Rebozo Dolomokodi Mahaya Abba Baba 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 Andola Mahaya Azebeke Telebokodi Mahaya and the Namaka Kariandola makatola mahaya, akapa bopa beda bazata la mahaya. Any power fighting my greatness, open your mouth and begin to fight that power. Any power that says you'll never become greater, anda mokata la mahaya, azebekeri anda la mahaya. I want the greatness that was upon David. I want the greatness that was upon Solomon. I want the greatness that was upon Daniel. Father, I thank you that today you are rising and scattering every enemy of my destiny. Every enemy of my greatness, and I'm a kotala mahaya. Ire me keri ire ire boso dolo boko di mahaya. I wage a war against every power fighting my greatness. I shall do great things. Open your mouth and pray. I shall achieve great things. I shall do great things. And I'm a kotila mahaya. Any obstacle get out of my way. Abatola mahaya. Azatola mahaya. E kabaka dala mahaya. As I'm praying, my Father, my God, He is going before me and making the crooked place straight, breaking us under the bars of iron, removing every boulder, every restriction. I'm now in Psalm 45, verse 1 to 3. I will go before you and make the crooked place straight. I will break in pieces. The gates of brass, I will put us under the bars of iron. Oh, Father God, cause that scripture to come to pass. For you said further in that scripture, you will show me hidden riches treasures of darkness oh father god take me to my place of real wealth that scripture is in the word of god take me to my place of real wealth in the name of jesus come on pray it through psalm 45 verse 1 to 3 you better pray it through as if it is a level Korea no la mahaya as if it is a little Korea no la mahaya at a baka da la maka to la mahaya oh come as a la mahaya command fixes for Jacob oh God command fixes for Rodney oh God you better put your name in there command fixes uh, command fixes uh, in the maka to la mahaya command fixes for Albert open your mouth and pray and the maka to la mahaya command fixes for gift open your mouth and pray command fixes for our wallet Open your mouth and pray. Command victories for Nicodemus. Open your mouth and pray. Command victories for Obed. Open your mouth and pray. It's in the Bible. Command victories for Jacob. Oh God. Substitute Jacob and put your name there. What are you doing? You are releasing the victory anointing. Father God, I want to live under a place of commanded blessing. For when God says yes, who can say no? When God says the blessing must be released, who can say no? Command fixes, command fixes. Baba Boka Zandola Mahaya Anna Makota Lama Zeta Lama Haya Eka Baba Katola Mahaya Aza Boka Telebe Keri Anna Lama Haya Aza Boka Di Anna Lama Haya Anna Rebe Keri Anna Lama Haya Anna Lama Kata Lama Haya I speak Genesis chapter number 30 Verse number 43 over your life That's the man He's talking about Jacob He became exceedingly prosperous Anna Makota Lama Haya Father I want you to release This scripture upon my life 
exceeding prosperity. You better open your mouth and pray. Genesis 30 verse 43, exceeding prosperity. I don't want normal wealth. I want exceeding prosperity. I want prosperity that evangelizes. Any power that fights excessive prosperity in my life, I wage a war against that power. In the name of Jesus, spirit of poverty in my family, I address you today by the fire of the Holy Ghost, by the power in the blood of Jesus. Any spirit in my family that says you are not supposed to possess your possessions, that spirit in my family, I subdue you in the name of Jesus. Excessive wealth, Musa. Excessive wealth, Musa. Excessive wealth. Excessive wealth. Excessive wealth. I release it upon my life. Somebody breakthroughs are being released here today. I'm telling you the truth. Hey! Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. Hey, Kazatola Mahaya. Keep praying, 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 keep praying. Something must happen today. For today is your day of turn around. Today is the day that God changes your story. Today is the day where God puts it in your hands to prosper. Today is the day KPM. Open your mouth. It's your day today, 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 today. Open your mouth and pray with agency. Step up, step up, step up, step up. Step up 20 more minutes. Step it up, step it up, step it up. That which you've been waiting for. For months on end, Adama Katala Mahaya, as the dead ever carry and Dola Mahaya, and Damakotala Mahaya. You don't get breakthroughs by folding your hands. You better open your mouth and pray. Any spirit that comes to fight you last minute, any foul spirit that fights you last minute, in the name of Jesus, we destroy that power, we destroy that hold of the enemy, we clear the path spiritually. In the name of Jesus, we release the blood of Jesus upon the path. In the name of Jesus. Any last minute failure, any last minute disaster, we destroy it in the name of Jesus. We come against people changing their minds last minute. Whatever powers that invoke bad luck in the last minute. And we destroy that power today in the name of Jesus. Command victories for Jacob. Oh God, command victories. Oh God must put a testimony in your mouth. Pray your way to a testimony somebody. Pray your way to a testimony somebody. Every family spirit that wages a war against you and says you will not make it that family spirit, it must be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Family sacrifices that are working against your future. Every satanic sacrifice against your progress, that sacrifice, it must be subdued. It must be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every sacrifice that was done against you with a wicked intent. We destroy that sacrifice in the name of Jesus. Oh, Jesus, have mercy on us. We are fighting many battles. We need your help today. Command victories, oh God. Command victories, oh God. Save now, I pray, oh God. Send now prosperity. We are in Psalm 118 verse 25 now. Send now prosperity. There are things that must happen now, 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 now. Send now prosperity. Oh God, I'm praying that scripture into existence. I'm a giver. I'm a tither. I sacrifice on God's altar. I support the work of God. So based on that, on that on those sacrifices, I decree this scripture. Send now prosperity. Oh God, I have kingdom commitments that I'm saying, Father, if you do these things for me, I will do great things for your kingdom. I will do great things for your kingdom. I will help to build your house. Even as you said of the centurion that this must be done for him. Why? He is a kingdom builder. I am a kingdom builder. Father bless me because I'm a kingdom builder. Put him down. I'm a kingdom builder. I'm a kingdom builder. Kingdom builders. Kingdom builders. Kingdom builders. God release the blessing upon anyone under the sound of my voice who has intentions of building God's house. Release the blessing of God. Do not allow the enemy to keep holding their breakthrough. 
Mata Bahaya, and the Mahaya. My Father, my God, do not allow the enemy to subvert, do not allow the enemy to block, do not allow the enemy to hinder their breakthroughs. For they are kingdom builders, under the sound of my voice, they are people who genuinely want to do great things in God's house. Father, do not allow them to be hindered by the enemy, do not allow them to be blocked by the enemy. Now, my Father, my God, even as you have told me today that by the power of the Holy Ghost, you are breaking every single barrier in the way of your children in the name of Jesus. Every satanic barrier must be broken. Lo gabado badi bandi mazato bahaya. Every barrier to their success is breaking today in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost. Any satanic resistance is breaking. Ma tabahaya. Oh, labado baki lari bahaya. Holy Ghost, break every resistance operating against the lives of God's children in the name of Jesus. We break witchcraft resistance in the name of Jesus. Family witchcraft must be broken. Any witchcraft which is which is working against God's children in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, we subdue you this morning, God. Family witchcraft be broken. National witchcraft be broken. Any curses operating in the lives of God's children. I declare and I decree that the curses are breaking right now. In the name of Jesus. I break every spell operating in your life in the name of Jesus today we say no to failure you will no longer fail from today going forward in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost right now I take this opportunity to break every stronghold operating against your life in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost. Every satanic stronghold I command you to break. Satanic limitations placed upon your life, they are breaking this morning. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Mahaya. There shall be no more frustrations operating in your life. Every spirit sponsoring frustrations. I frustrate that spirit by the power of the Holy Ghost. Oh, I destroy satanic hindrances. Any hindrances in your way must be removed. Any barrier must be removed. In the name name of Jesus. Any satanic bars that have been placed in your way so you do not access your kingdom prosperity. Those bars are broken according to Isaiah 45. In the name of Jesus. Oh, I break every satanic embargo placed upon your life so that you do not enter certain realms of prosperity. That embargo must be broken in the name of Jesus. Any disappointment that you have faced year after year, month after month, week after week, day after day. Those disappointments I commanded turn around. In the name of Jesus, every satanic yoke is breaking because of the anointing according to Isaiah 10 verse 27. Lo kaba dalama ka dalama haya. I speak against every adversity in your life, every satanic adversity. God, I command in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost that angels will be moved, will begin to move and turn around that situation. Today we address every satanic accusation placed upon the lives of God's children that would cause them not to rise and not to prosper. Those accusations 
organizations. We command them to fall down to the ground in the name of Jesus. Every satanic decree placed over your life that is working against your destiny, I command that decree, decree to fall down to the ground in the name of Jesus. Today there is an anointing and I release that anointing, the anointing to remove burdens in the name of Jesus. Any burden placed over your life by the enemy is removed in the name of Jesus. I remove evil plantations placed upon your life in the name of Jesus. Any tree that my father has not planted is uprooted today in the name of Jesus. So today we uproot evil plantations placed by your life by the enemy in the name of Jesus evil prophecies you are nullified now in the name of Jesus any satanic prophecy satanic projections placed upon your life they must be removed right now in the name of Jesus arrows of disappointment arrows of failure arrows of delays no more shall they operate in your life in the name of Jesus there shall be no more delays any satanic influence over your life it comes to an end this day in the name of Jesus. I bind every satanic oppression in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost I command total deliverance from all affliction in your life. In the name of Jesus. The Bible says upon Mount Zion there shall be deliverance. Then there shall be holiness. And the house of Jacob shall possess their possessions. My Father, my God, let this prayer be unto deliverance. That will cause your children to possess their possessions in the name of Jesus. Oh, Kabasa Tola Mahaya. Hey, Labasa Tola Mahaya. I release the fire of God against every satanic enemy working against your life. In the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, I release power from above that to operate in your life. In the name of Jesus, I command multiple doors to open for you. Hey, Labada Labasa Tola Mahaya. I go on the God of heaven to come down in his majesty. Come down with your sword, my father, my God, and destroy evil powers in the name of Jesus. Come down with the fire of the Holy Ghost and destroy the powers of witchcraft. Come down, O God, by the power that is in the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, the blood of Jesus must speak for us. The blood that speaks better things than the blood of Cain and the blood of Abel. In the name of Jesus, we of God, oh, arise and defend us in the name of Jesus. I call on the God who comes down in his thunder to destroy every satanic altar working against us in the name of Jesus. Today I call on the judgment of God against every satanic altar in the name of Jesus. Every satanic altar receive the judgment of God. I destroy every evil altar in the name of Jesus. Altars of failure be destroyed. Lord Abakota God's children will not fail anymore in the name of Jesus. Every satanic proverb that is working against God's children, I command that proverb to fall down to the ground in the name of Jesus. Evil altars of poverty, I command them to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. God's children, you will no longer fail in the name of Jesus. Altars of sickness and disease, be it destroyed right now in the name of Jesus. Altars that are releasing death, I destroy those evil altars in the name of Jesus. Spirit of death, I arrest you. Now I declare and I decree, Lord, even as you have commanded me, that every altar where there's a sacrifice working against God's children, I silence those altars in the name of Jesus. Every evil altar that has a fresh satanic sacrifice that is speaking against you. I command that altar to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. The voices that are emanating from evil altars, I silence those voices in the name of Jesus. Lo kabadila ramazo talamahaya. Altars that are releasing her. Delays. Delays to breakthroughs. Delays to financial breakthroughs. Delays to healing. Delays to deliverance. All such altars be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Lo kabadila ramazo talamahaya. 
Mazatola Mahaya. Altars releasing frustrations. Be ye destroyed in the name of Jesus. I destroy those evil altars in the name of Jesus. And by the power of the Holy Ghost, those altars they are being destroyed right now. I release angels, warring angels, to go into the enemy's camp and destroy every evil altar in the name of Jesus. Lo Kamaza Tola Maze Kalarabahaya. Mandala Bakota la Maketa la Maza Tola Mahaya. Every anti African altar altars that work against Africans. I command those altars to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Now I speak over the lives of God's children and I decree every evil mark placed upon them must be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Marks of bad luck be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Satanic markings, I remove them by the power that is in the blood of Jesus. I counsel every evil covenant in your family that is working against you and against your destiny. Every evil covenant be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Generational curses be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every single generational curse working against you, I destroy those curses in the name of Jesus. Like father, like son syndrome, be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Like mother, like daughter syndrome, be destroyed in the name of Jesus. The failures of, of, of your forefathers shall not be your failure in the name of Jesus. Where your forefathers failed, you will succeed in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree your delayed miracle is manifesting now. Your delayed progress is manifesting now. In the name of Jesus, I break the power of barrenness over your life. No more barrenness in your life. No more barrenness in your business. No more barrenness in your marriage. No more barrenness in your finances. No more barrenness on the marketplace. In the name of Jesus, I take this opportunity to destroy and to dismiss spirit husbands and spirit wives that are working against you. I break every Every evil spiritual marriage in the name of Jesus. Guardian demons that are following you around. You foul spirits, familiar spirits, I command you to go in the name of Jesus. You should no longer pursue God's children. You must no longer follow them in the name of Jesus. It doesn't matter what covenants were made. Evil covenants, they must be destroyed in the name of Jesus. I speak against every demonic power and I command judgment upon them. In the name of Jesus, I release divine judgment upon every demonic force working against you in the name of Jesus. Every hired occultist, every hired satanist that is being used to frustrate you, I destroy the power of that satanic altar. In the name of Jesus, I frustrate every satanic device hired against God's children, being used against God's children. In the name of Jesus, be ye set free. I declare and I decree, every evil force holding your money must lose in the name of Jesus. Every demonic power holding your resources, sitting on your finances, I command that power to go in the name of Jesus. Angels assist in this warfare. Angels of God assist us in our supernatural prosperity. In the name of Jesus, I command the stopping and the destroying of every unnecessary delay. No more delays in your life in the name of Jesus. Lord, be ye exempted from the economic meltdown. Whatever others are experiencing that is negative, you shall not experience. Where others are saying there's a downsetting, you will say there's an uprising. In the name of Jesus, I declare and I decree divine opportunities are your portion. Receive your divine opportunity it is in the name of Jesus. Lord, your delayed document, I declare and I decree they are coming to the fore. That delayed signature must be signed in your favor in the name of Jesus. Signatures by kings that will change your lives. I command those signatures to be released in the name of Jesus. Your delayed documents, no more delays in the name of Jesus. Receive help from above. May you receive help from above in the name of Jesus. Father, you said you would help us. I release divine help upon the children of God right now in the name of Jesus. May there be accelerated progress in the lives of God's children in the name of Jesus. Your delayed harvest must manifest now in the name of Jesus. Every seed you have ever sown in God's kingdom, I command it to yield a positive harvest in the name of Jesus. I release open heavens over 
over your life. I declare and I decree, whatever you set your hands to do will prosper from today. In the name of Jesus, receive the grace for strange results on the marketplace. Strange positive results on the marketplace. In the name of Jesus. Oh, my Father, my God, according to Psalm 38, verse 22, hasten to help them, my Father, my God. According to Psalm 143, verse number 7, hear them speedily as they pray, as they cry out unto you. How long will you look, O Lord? Renew their strength, my Father, my God, in the name of Jesus. Holy Ghost, fire, drive up the spirit of delay. In the name of Jesus, save now, I pray, O God. Send now prosperity, Psalm 118, verse 25. I release divine speed, divine speed, the God kind of speed. I release the God speed, God speed upon the lives of your children. In the name of Jesus, may they receive divine speed. Divine speed is the portion of your children. In the name of Jesus, intervene, my Father, my God, in their lives. Whatever they are working on and they are not succeeding, Lord, they need divine intervention. They can't do this by themselves, my Father, my God. So I cry out for divine intervention in the name of Jesus. Restore the lost time, the time that has been lost in the lockdown. Restore, my Father, my God. I pray that you would restore the time that has been lost in the name of Jesus. Father, I know that with one or two transactions, we can be restored. Restore the years that the canker worm have, the, have stolen from us, have eaten from us in the name of Jesus. Lord, I command speedy results in this 2021. Speedy results, quick results. Father, you are God who can do a quick work. I come against snail spirit. I come against total spirit. In the name of Jesus, may their destinies be fulfilled. May their dreams be fulfilled. In the name of Jesus, so negative words spoken against them for them to be slowed down I come against those negative words in the name of Jesus now my father my God deal with the enemy at the gate the enemy at the gate of breakthrough must be destroyed in the name of Jesus for a great door has opened unto me but there are many adversaries my father my God deal with every adversary at the door of breakthrough in the name of Jesus every door that has closed I command that door to open right now in the name of Jesus behold I set before you an open door and doors that God opens no man can shut every door that is closed in front of you may your God may your God may your God open that door in the name of Jesus I declare and I decree your children are entering through through these doors in the name of Jesus. Every gatekeeper, satanic gatekeeper at doors of breakthroughs, I dismiss you by the power of the Holy Ghost. Be ye dismissed. Loose the children of God. Loose those doors so that they may enter. Every chain at the door of breakthrough must be destroyed. Every chain at the gate of breakthrough must be destroyed. I break every chain in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree God's children will not be tied down to one place. The power of stagnation is broken in the name of Jesus. Every power of stagnation holding you down, delaying your progress, stopping you from moving forward. This night, I command that power to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. You will testify of the goodness of God. In the name of Jesus, Lord, I break every satanic covenant in your family that causes you not to make progress. I destroy that covenant. It doesn't matter whatever agreement was made with the forefathers and Lucifer. We cancel that agreement in the name of Jesus. May you be connected to the covenant of Jehovah in the name of Jesus. Every family covenant, every family satanic agreement, satanic handwritings of ordinances that are contrary to your destiny, they are not your portion in the name of Jesus. So Lo ba kelerebe keri ando la boka dilala mahaya. Oh 
release miracle transactions in the name of Jesus that will help you to catch up. Strongholds are breaking right now in the name of Jesus. As you pray this prayer, as you repeat this prayer, there shall be manifestations of the goodness of God in the name of Jesus. I shake evil foundations today in the name of Jesus. As Paul and Silas were praying the prison where they were, the foundation was shaken. I shake the foundation of every evil satanic prison in your family. In the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, the power of struggle is broken in the name of Jesus. Satanic arrows of delay and disappointment you are destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every evil voice activating delay be destroyed, be shut down. Power of retrogression, you are not their portion in the name of Jesus. Power of stagnation, no more. Chains of stagnation break right now in the name of Jesus. I destroy the power of rise and fall in the name of Jesus. Familiar spirits following God's children be destroyed right now. In the name of Jesus, I command you to catch fire. Satanic delaying tactics be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Everything written against us by the enemy, satanic handwritings of ordinances, contrary to our destiny, be blotted out by the power that is in the blood of Jesus. Arrows of disappointment, I command you to catch fire. No more disappointments, no more being told tomorrow, tomorrow. I command the release of breakthroughs. They must be released in the name of Jesus. The power of hardship be broken. Power of hardship break in the name of Jesus. Power of hardship be broken in the name of Jesus. You power of automatic failure be destroyed in the name of Jesus. I reverse that evil programming over your life. I program only the goodness of the Lord in the name of Jesus. And by the power of the Holy Ghost. Father God arise and have mercy on your children. For it is their set time to be blessed in the name of Jesus. Their progress must no longer be postponed, oh my Father, my God. For hope deferred makes the heart sick. I release promotions, I release elevations, I release enlargements in the name of Jesus. May decisions be made in the favor of your children in the name of Jesus. No more delays in positive decisions. In the name of Jesus, the blessing shall no longer be postponed in the name of Jesus. The new level shall no longer be postponed in the name of Jesus. The delayed houses, properties and land shall no longer be postponed in the name of Jesus. Even as I'm praying this prayer, your children shall no longer be hindered in the name of Jesus. They shall no longer be prolonged, no longer delayed, no longer suspended, blocked or frustrated in the name of Jesus. My Father, my God, what you promised us must no longer be withheld by the enemy. Take it out of the hands of the enemy today in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree from today going forward who will no longer be slowed down by the enemy, who will no longer be confined or arrested to one place in the name of Jesus. Those who have been discouraged, Father, may they be encouraged again in the Lord. Now I speak Isaiah 45 over the lives of your children. Father God, I pray that you'll go before them. According to Isaiah 45 verse number 2, you would make the crooked places straight, break in pieces the gates of brass. Cut asunder the bars of iron. My Father, my God, I pray that hidden riches and treasures of darkness will be released upon your children. And common breakthroughs must be released in the name of Jesus. Lord, I believe in you, my Father, my God, in the name of Jesus. 
Now I speak over their finances and I decree no more financial barrenness, no more financial dryness. The spirit of poverty is broken. The power of the valley is broken in the name of Jesus. I release an overtaking blessing upon the lives of your children. May the blessing come upon them and overtake them. I command a serious business turn around in the name of Jesus. May their financial progress be obvious in the name of Jesus. I release progress all around in the name of Jesus. Now I speak to their asset base and I command that asset base to grow in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree nothing shall be impossible for your children. And common speed shall be their portion in the name of Jesus. I release the power to prosper, the power to prosper. May they prosper and use your prosperity upon the lives of your children. In the name of Jesus, power to get wealth is released in the name of Jesus. Power to seal contracts, signed, sealed and delivered. Every contract must turn into money in the name of Jesus. May their gifts be recognized. My Father, my God, I declare and I decree anyone, oh Father, who you have assigned to bless them, who you have assigned to be their destiny helper, may they never ignore your children in the name of Jesus. They can no longer be ignored in the name of Jesus. Multiple doors will open for you in the name of Jesus. I command unlimited resources. That is your portion, child of God. Unlimited resources. No more limited resources. In the name of Jesus, I release a bumper harvest upon your life. Every seed you have ever sown in the kingdom, receive a bumper harvest. I decree over your life, whatever you set your hands to do, God must cause it to prosper from this day going forward. Whatever you set your hands to do will prosper. In the name of Jesus, I decree financial rest. Rest all around financially. In the name of Jesus, may you rise above your bills. May there be more provision than bills. In the name of Jesus. I decree you are entering a realm of uncontested blessing in the name of Jesus. You will be honored everywhere. May God give you your place in society. May God give you your place in history. In the name of Jesus, I release spiritual empowerment. Power to prosper. Receive that power this day. In the name of Jesus, I release the ten times more grace, ten times better, ten times better, ten times better than your competitors, ten times better than your relatives, ten times better than your haters. Receive that grace in the name of Jesus. I receive the grace of God. The Bible says in Deuteronomy 1 verse 11, I will make you a thousand times more than you are, oh, both you and your children. I receive a thousand times more favor, a thousand times more anointing, a thousand times more grace. May you be profitable all the time. I decree profitability over your life in the name of Jesus. No more losses permitted in your life. You are not permitted to make losses in the name of Jesus. Now in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, I declare and I decree profitable relationships shall be your portion. May God grant you profitable relationships. May he give you divine connections divine connections you'll be divinely connected in the name of Jesus my father my God release divine connections upon the lives of your children send them destiny help us 
people to help them with their destinies people to help them oh my father my god with their projects people to help them with their careers people to help them with their ministries divine helpers are assigned by you in the name of jesus now i take this opportunity to unlock international opportunities upon your life i command that grace upon your life international opportunities are opening up in the name of jesus make people like you on every side May you be like Esther, who everyone who saw her, they liked her, Esther 215, and they favored her. Ah, Kabatala Mahaya. Oh, Lababadala Bakota Mazatola Mahaya. May God cause your face to shine in the name of Jesus. I release the grace for unexpected deals, unexpected transactions in the name of Jesus. And by the power of the Holy Ghost, receive the acceleration grace upon your life in the name of Jesus. May you be accelerated. May you have speed. Oh, la bakata la mahaya. Hey, le be keriende le bakata la mahaya. I command the release of breakthroughs, unlimited breakthroughs in the name of Jesus. May it be breakthrough after breakthrough in the name of Jesus. Opportunity after opportunity to the glory of God. I release massive marketplace miracles, massive marketplace miracles in the name of Jesus. Now I release divine inheritance upon your life in the name of Jesus. Even as Samuel said to Saul in First Samuel chapter 10, verse number 1, I am making you commander over inheritance. I release that grace upon your life, child of God. You will be a commander over inheritance in the name of Jesus. In your family, you must be at the top of the tree. Headship grace, headship grace, headship grace. Receive it in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree, sweatless victories, they are your portion. In the name of Jesus, I declare and I decree you are walking into your promised land. Ah, spiritually, I hold your hand today into your promised land. In the name of Jesus, as you have conquered giants, you will enter the promised land. In the name of Jesus, I speak Psalm 112. Wealth and riches shall be in your house. I speak Psalm 115. May God increase you more and more, both you and your children have received the Abrahamic blessing in the name of Jesus. Supernatural breakthroughs, they are your portion. By the grace of God, your level is changing. Your level is changing supernaturally. Enter new realms from today. New realms of grace. New realms of power. Our new realms of financial grace in the name of Jesus. I release heavenly resources upon your life in the name of Jesus. Now I declare and I decree. I release the money grace. The money grace is coming upon you. Oh, la bado bagila raba haya. You are receiving territorial dominion. You will dominate in your territory. You will dominate in your area in the name of Jesus. And la bako namasato la mahaya. I command financial favor upon your life. You are a recipient of financial favor today. No more lack in your life. In the name of Jesus, I command the graceful real estate to come upon your life. You will have houses you did not build, vineyards you did not plant, wells you did not dig. I decree that grace upon your life. May you have victory all around. I decree you are victorious on every side. Victory on every side, victory on every side. I command unlimited success. No more limits on your success. Ah, Lari Andola Mahaya. You are moving from adversity to advancement. You are advancing, Kabada Mahaya. By the grace of God, Kabadoba Zato Mahaya. Hey, 
may you be elevated beyond your wildest imagination may God elevate you promotion does not come from the east or the west but it comes from above your God is elevating you I command supernatural increase in the name of Jesus I speak Genesis 26 upon your life the man Isaac he began to prosper he continued to prosper until he became very prosperous may that be your portion you will become very prosperous in the land in the name of Jesus oh oh you are entering the God kind of prosperity and save now I pray Psalm 118 verse 25 send now prosperity oh God send now prosperity oh God oh la baba go la baka di la rama haya eh la baba ba le ba haya you will possess your possessions in the land in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost you will be a possessor of possessions mandada ba do ba ke la di da ba haya oh la de ba go da ma ka te le re bo ko di ma haya ah ka pa ta la ma haya once again receive the power to prosper receive the power to prosper you are receiving it the Bible says uh, do not forget the Lord your God uh, for it is he who gives power to get wealth uh, I declare and I decree uh, every tither every partner of ministry anyone who supports God's work uh, and is under the sound of my voice uh, I declare and I decree uh, receive power to prosper receive the power to prosper I declare and I decree uh, all your prophecies are being fulfilled uh, they shall be no more delays over your prophecy. No more delays over your prophecy. Every prophecy shall be fulfilled. It must be fulfilled in the name of Jesus. Oh, let the bekenda mazotalamahaya. Enter ye into a prophecy fulfillment season. In the name of Jesus, I command undeniable breakthroughs upon your life. Receive undeniable breakthroughs. Mando baki now I decree under the anointing that you will be a trailblazer in the name of Jesus. You will be a pace setter. You will be a record breaker. Receive the parents anointing. May you have the overtakers anointing upon your life. You will overtake those who went before you that are unbelievers. You must overtake them. Receive the overtaker's anointing in the name of Jesus. May you have the grace for results today and common results. I release the grace for excellence. Excellence, excellence. That was upon Daniel. Receive an excellent spirit in the name of Jesus. Today receive pure kingdom prosperity grace manda bakola basato la mahaya e la baba do bakila la mahaya even as i've been laboring in the night for this anointing i release it upon you in the name of jesus manda la bakata la mahaya even as paul said in romans 111 how i long to see you ah kabata la mahaya that i may release a spiritual gift unto you that in the end there in you may be established Receive establishment grace. Oh, I believe in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, kingdom influencers are being raised. In the name of Jesus, receive the grace to be an influencer in the kingdom. May you be influential for the sake of the kingdom. You influence on the marketplace in the name of Jesus. Receive the grace to become a kingdom star. You will be a star to the glory of God in the name of Jesus. Now I release the grace that was upon Mark 1 verse 37. Master, all men seek for you. All men are looking for you. Receive the grace for all men to look for you.
for you. The magnetic grace in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree your voice will be heard all around the world. All around the world they will hear your voice. Manda bakilari da bojali de de kedebo la da da baga da da baga de de ze telebo kodi bahaya. The world must hear your voice. The world must hear your voice. Your customers must hear your voice. Anda bakata la mahaya. The government must hear your voice. Anda bakota mahaya. Civil authority must hear your voice. I decree your voice will be heard all over the world. You are becoming an international brand. Oh, I pray somebody is receiving this. You are becoming an international brand in the name of Jesus. Receive the grace to be a general in this dispensation. Generational grace to be a general. Receive it in the name of Jesus. Today under the anointing, I decree that your voice is amplified in the name of Jesus. Any satanic veil that has been placed on your life so that you are not visible, that veil is removed in the name of Jesus. May you be seen by people looking for you. May you be heard by people listening to you. In the name of Jesus, you will be a newsmaker. I declare and I decree your business will make news. Your ministry will make news in the positive. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Now I decree you will be God's voice on the marketplace. Wherever you are, may you be a voice of God in this land. In the name of Jesus. I release the fearful grace upon you. May men fear you. May men fear you. In the name of Jesus. Ah, Now I place a hedge of fire round about you. I decree divine protection over your life. I speak Psalm 91 over your life. For I know that by this prayer and because of your obedience to God, God is blessing and elevating you. And the enemy will raise up his head. But when the enemy shall come in like a flood, the Spirit of the Lord will raise a standard. Today I raise the power of the Holy Ghost all over your life. I raise the fire of the Holy Ghost all around you. You are surrounded by the fire of the Holy Ghost. There is a hedge of protection round about you like there was on Job. Now as I'm praying in the Holy Ghost, I'm releasing new angels round about you. New angels. Angels all around you, angels all around you, angels all around your house, angels with blazing swords all around your company, angels with you wherever you go. Ah, Baba Bada Bakati, Lara Bahaya, and that Babo Baba Baba Kadi, may God preserve you as you are his jewel divine protection divine protection over you even as God is increasing your greatness Psalm 71 verse 21 I decree he is also increasing your protection Today I cry out like David over your life. According to Psalm 3. Oh Lord, look, they have increased. Who hates me on every side? Who come against me on every side?
inside. Uh, they say there's no help for me in God. Uh, but you, O oh Lord, are my shield, uh, my glory and the lifter of my head. Uh, my Father, my God, uh, shield us from all enemies. Uh, shield us on every side. Uh, shield us from armed robbers. Uh, shield us from spiritual affliction. Uh, shield us from witch covens. Uh, shield us from the occult. Uh, shield us from satanists. Uh, shield us from haters. Uh, shield us from family witches. Uh, shield us, oh Father God. Uh, you are our shield and our butler. Uh, we want to dwell uh, under the shadow of the almighty God. Uh, protection over our assets. Uh, protection over our children. Uh, protection over our businesses. Uh, protection over our ministries. Uh, protection over our transactions. Uh, protection over everything that concerns us. Uh, on every side, divine protection. Uh, and oh, bakila rabahaya. And ala baba 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 bakoda bakadi. Dadadahaya. As I'm praying now, every satanic plan is falling down to the ground. Every strategy of the enemy, every device of the enemy is being dismantled. I dismantle satanic devices. I destroy satanic plans. Get your loins and be broken in pieces. Speak your counsel and it shall come to naught. For the Lord God is with us. God is our helper. God is with us. We do not fear the enemy. For our God, our God is with us. And if God be for us, who can be against us? Oh, as we drive in the highways and the byways we are protected as we are in our homes we are protected as we go for meetings we are protected as we are on the marketplace we are protected as we go to the house of God we are protected as we go to the supermarket we are protected wherever we are we are protected I release that divine protection upon you child of God. In the name of Jesus, I command honor that comes from God. My Father, my God, I know that even whatever words I'm speaking, they shall come to pass. My Father, my God, according to Isaiah 44, 26, you back up every word that I speak. Lord, what I'm speaking over your children, back it up in the name of Jesus. I command major deals and contracts to be signed. I command supernatural influence upon the lives of your children. In the name of Jesus, may they have an encounter with unusual grace as they are listening to this prayer. As they are praying, praying along in this prayer, Lord God, may they have unusual, unusual financial grace come upon their lives. Those desiring the millionaire's grace, those that sow a seed, oh God, for the millionaire's grace, I command that grace to fall upon them in the name of Jesus. I release the Abrahamic blessing upon the lives of your children. In the name of Jesus, I command strange financial breakthroughs, uncommon financial breakthroughs. The anointing that attracts wealth, may it be the portion of your children. In the name of Jesus, may they enter into a place of prepared blessings, prepared breakthroughs. In the name of Jesus, may they reach an on-time blessing. Before the need arises, may the finances be there. May your children never be stranded in the name of Jesus. Now unto him who is able to do exceedingly abundant Above all, they may ask or think. May you over answer their prayers. May you surprise them in the name of Jesus. The voice of haters shall be silenced in the name of Jesus. I command unusual defense over the lives of your children in the name of Jesus. Anyone fighting your children goes down instantly in the name of Jesus. May death be far from their house in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost. I command supernatural mouth multiplication in the name of Jesus. May they be enlarged in this territory in Zimbabwe and beyond the borders in the name of Jesus. I command supernatural fruitfulness. May they be fruitful and then may they multiply. I command supernatural financial dominion. May they dominate their financial commitments. 
Grant them the grace to pay. Grant them the grace to pay. I release divine ideas, godly ideas that come from you. May they fulfill their destiny, their vision in the name of Jesus. I command the market share to increase. Wherever you place them on the market, my Father, my God, cause their market share to increase. Manda mazo da ba she talida ba haya. Manda ba kota la ba kota la ma haya. New businesses shall be opened in the name of Jesus to your glory, my Father, my God. Ma lerebe ke diando la ba kato ma haya. I prophesy new businesses to be opened. I prophesy uncommon favor in the name of Jesus. I prophesy uncommon opportunities to come in the name of Jesus. Everything that they touch from today must be blessed. In the name of Jesus, may they enter the realm of no room enough, no labako talama haya, the realm of too much blessing. In the name of Jesus, all the monies that are locked must be unlocked. Labako damaza talama haya. I stand in the gap as a man of God, and I declare and I decree in the name of Jesus, all the locked monies I command them to be unlocked. In the name of Jesus, the curses placed on their money must be. Re- Moved the curse of delayed financial blessing be removed. Receive divine acceleration in the name of Jesus. Today I break the power of toiling. No more toiling in the name of Jesus. Your ideas will become international in the name of Jesus. And by the power of the Holy Ghost, the grace for real estate must come. In the name of Jesus, may you receive a consistent flow of blessings in the name of Jesus. May you receive daily benefits loaded upon your life. According to Psalm, Psalm 68, verse number 19, in the name of Jesus. May God increase your savings in the name of Jesus. Every hole in your pocket be sewn up by the power of the Holy Ghost. No more losses shall be experienced by you. I break the power of the devourer in the name of Jesus. May you have a good name. May you have a good reputation even on the marketplace in the name of Jesus. I activate the grace for good decisions. May you never make bad decisions in the name of Jesus. I release a season of wealth transfer. The wealth of the wicked shall be laid up for the just. Receive the wealth of the wicked in the name of Jesus. May you become a star in God's kingdom. May you become a star like Daniel. May you become a star like Joseph. May you become a star like Solomon. May you be a star like David in the name of Jesus. I command cycles of blessings to be activated over your life. In the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost. I command the heavens to remain opened over your life. The heavens will never close again over your life. Grace for maximum impact is your portion. The grace for generational wealth is released upon your life. In the name of Jesus. Everything that has not been working will start working from now. May God open your eyes to see opportunities in the name of Jesus. And come grace is coming upon you. You are no longer the same person as you were. May you be turned into another man like Saul. After he had an encounter with Samuel, even by this encounter with this prayer, may you be turned into another man. In the name of Jesus, may you flourish like the trees planted by the rivers of living water. In the name of Jesus, I command unusual angelic assistance with your prosperity. In the name of Jesus, may you be multiplied and not remain small according to Jeremiah 30 verse number 19. In the name of Jesus you will not be few. You will not be few. You will be multiplied in the name of Jesus. You will not be small. You will be glorified in the name of Jesus. I declare and I decree men on the marketplace they must favor you. They must favor you. May you have an encounter with kings on the marketplace. May you serve kings on the marketplace. May you be paid from the treasuries of kings 
things in the name of Jesus. I release Genesis chapter 30 verse number 43 upon your life. Exceeding prosperity, exceeding prosperity. I release that upon your life in the name of Jesus. The grace for real deals must come upon your life in the name of Jesus. You no longer survive on crumbs, but the real deals shall be your portion in the name of Jesus. May you have the grace for real results in the name of Jesus. May you be a representative of the God kind of prosperity in the name of Jesus. Strange wealth, unexplainable wealth shall be your portion. Unexplainable riches shall be your portion in the name of Jesus. May you be 10 times better than all your competitors. May you be 10 times better than all your relatives in the name of Jesus. Jesus. May people come to the saving knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ because of what God is doing in your life. May people truly see that you walk with God, that you move with God in the name of Jesus. Even as they said about Joseph, that truly we can see that God is with this man. For no man can do these things except God be with them. Oh, May God be glorified through you. Galatians 1.24 in the name of Jesus, I prophesy that all influential men will look for you. Ah, Kabadola Mahaya, Mark 137. All men seek for you. All men seek for you. May your fame be spread abroad in the positive in the name of Jesus. Any negativity surrounding your name, I crush it in the name of Jesus. Lo, Kabadola Makotala Mahaya. May your gifts be celebrated. May your skills be celebrated. May your business this proposal will be celebrated. May you be welcomed by kings. I see the gates to the palace opening for you. In the name of Jesus, doors to government must be open to you. Doors to civil authorities must be open to you. In the name of Jesus, may men be compelled to bless you. I compel men, I'm a counsel, to bless you in the name of Jesus. Any legal case against you is settled in your favor. In the name of Jesus, it is settled in your favor. May people desire to help you. In the name of Jesus, may they help you with your dreams. I command brand new victories for you. Oh, I feel the anointing on this prayer. Results are coming. Brand new victories. They are your portion in the name of Jesus. I release the grace for continuous testimonies upon your life. Every single day, may God put a testimony in your mouth. Uncommon opportunities. They are your portion. The blessing of timing is your portion. Right place at the right time. In the name of Jesus, I command unusual discounts over your life. That is your portion in the name of Jesus. May you be promoted in God's kingdom and elevated in the name of Jesus. Every investment of yours, whether spiritual or natural, may you receive a return on investment. In the name of Jesus, hidden blessings, they are released in your favor. In the name of Jesus, may you be free from sickness. May you be free from the spirit of death. In the name of Jesus. Jealousy, witchcraft that attacks people because of rising. I squash it in the name of Jesus. May God increase your greatness according to Psalm 21 verse 71. I see him increasing your greatness in the name of Jesus. I prophesy. God is increasing your greatness in the name of Jesus. I command long life upon you in the name of Jesus. May you live long and may you live strong in the name of Jesus. Jesus. New cars, they are your portion. You will enjoy her. You will ride prosperously because of truth according to the word of God. The grace to make a difference in this generation. May you receive that grace in the name of Jesus. You will live in financial liberty in the name of Jesus. This prayer is breaking the spirit of poverty and releasing the spirit of prosperity or the power to prosper every tither uh, and every partner of the ministry that listens to this prayer may you benefit from this prayer in the name of Jesus the ceiling over your breakthroughs is removed no more limits no more limits I break the powers of limitation in the name of Jesus I release new business contracts in your favor in the name of Jesus 
prosperity roadblocks they are removed in the name of jesus according to psalm 138 verse 7 and 8 may god perfect everything that concerns you in the name of jesus receive a godly character to go with that wealth in the name of jesus manda makota la mahaya i speak psalm 112 wealth and riches shall be in your house and righteousness shall also be your portion holiness shall be your portion in the name of jesus now i command your diverted blessings to return to you in the name of jesus your diverted blessings they are coming to you any deadly disease that comes to you because you are rising i destroy that spirit in the name of jesus the wealth that comes by prophecy is your portion in the name of jesus may your bonds be filled with plenty in the name of jesus may you have supernatural favor in the name of jesus your vision shall be fulfilled according to the word of god people will look up to you as you look up to god may you be a mentor to this generation may people around you want to be mentored by you because they see results because you are marvelously helped like uziah second chronicles 26 verse number 15 may you be marvelously helped by god in the name of jesus may you be a giant in this territory in the name of jesus may you experience the reality of god's blessing the reality of kingdom prosperity shall be your portion may grace be poured upon your lips according to psalm 45 now i command the release of heavenly treasures upon your life they are released in your favor in the name of jesus may you grow in leaps and bounds according to the word of god may satanic barriers be broken broken in the name of jesus i declare and i decree from today you are a line crosser you are a barrier breaker you will break records in the positive in the name of jesus those who are into mining may your minds be opened in the name of jesus i command your spiritual eyes to be opened you will see opportunities all around you the power of hardship is broken in the name of jesus may you not only grow financially may you grow spiritually may you have authority over demonic powers may you be able to destroy the powers of the enemy just by your word may god strengthen your words may he give you a mouth that your enemies cannot resist according to luke 21 verse number 15 in the name of jesus you will celebrate this year in the name of jesus many will move from hardship to headship in the name of jesus the grace to manifest receive that grace in the name of Jesus. Lo kabadola mazeta la mahaya. Mandala bakata la makota mahaya. You will celebrate this year. You will celebrate this month in the name of Jesus. May God give you a reason to celebrate. Ma kabadola bazete le boko di bahaya. You are recovering all around in the name of Jesus. May God give you divine revelation, witty inventions, ideas in the name of jesus ideas after the order of google ideas after the order of whatsapp ideas that will take over the world may you receive such ideas in the name of jesus multiple streams of income that shall be your portion in the name of jesus now i command godly visitations divine encounters shall be your portion in the name of jesus i declare and i decree godly wisdom is your portion you will be wiser than people who are around you in the name of Jesus. People who look up to you for wisdom in the name of Jesus. So mahaya. No robbery shall befall you. No harm shall befall you. No losses shall befall you in the name of Jesus. May God send um, uh, faithful people around you. Good people around you. May God warn you of any danger. And may you be protected from any danger. May you be protected from any harm. In the name of Jesus. Now I declare and I decree that this prayer that I've prayed over you. Every prayer point that I've prayed over you. 
I speak and I decree in the name of Jesus. Every prayer I've prayed over you shall be answered. Even as you believe in this prayer, I declare and I decree you will see uncommon results. You will see uncommon results. In the name of Jesus. Lo Kabadola Mahaya. God bless you. It's Apostle Rodney Chipoera here. I've prayed this prayer with, uh, with love for you. Uh, those who are connected to me in any way. Those who are connected to our ministry. And for the body of Christ in general. Those who believe in this ministration. I declare and I decree. May you benefit from this prayer. Spread this prayer all around. And anyone who plays this prayer and spreads this prayer prayer i make a covenant with god today that anyone who would believe in this prayer and pray through this prayer and spread this prayer in the name of jesus i decree uncommon blessings uncommon financial grace in the name of jesus god bless you saints may you see results in Jesus' name. May you be protected by God himself. And may there be no comeback, satanic comeback, satanic retaliation against this prayer. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And amen. God bless you. It's Apostle Rodney Chipoera here. Kingdom Prosperity Ministries. Harare, Zimbabwe. Be blessed.